there's a fish. Finally. Whoa, whoa. That's that's a nice fish. He just screamed out drag. Today, we're fishing at this hot water discharge for big hybrid stripers. It's a cold early morning, so the fish are really active. Stick around and see the different fish we pull out of here. First thing I'm gonna be throwing this morning is this tiny sinking jerk bait and a basic shad color. Let's get it, guys. Red, first cast of the day. Guys, I got a fish already. There we go. That did not take long. What was that, three casts? Let's go. First fish, and it's a target species. Look at that fight. Look at that rod bend. Holy crap. That took three casts. Unbelievable. Well, I got out here before sunrise. It is currently just before 7 a.m. And we are already hooked on the target species. These guys fight so freaking hard too. Look at that. Unreal. These are some of my favorite fish to catch. It's not a bad fish. Wow, there we go. Let's go ahead, get this guy in whenever he's ready. Be careful not to get hooks. Yes, yeah, good. that's a good first fish. I will freaking take that. Look at that guys. Let's go ahead. Bring them on over here to the bank. If you guys are gonna grab these fish, you better hold very tight. There we go. On that very tiny seeking jerk bait, a little wrap of the countdown. Look at that fish. Beautiful hybrid striped bass. Look at that fish. Very sharp tines. Probably three pounds, three and a half. He's not that big, but out of curiosity, it is my first hybrid I've caught in a long time. I haven't really targeted these guys, so I am gonna get a quick wait before we send them off on this way. All right, got them on. what I say, about three, three and a half pounds? Three, seven, let's go guys. What a good first fish. Thank you, guy. Thank you for biting. Bite my thumb, you're free. Get out of here. Let's go, get your friend. So as you can see right there, that fish did bend my hook. This is a very small lure. So I probably should just set my drag even lighter than what it is. Very natural, very small. And there are a bunch of shad in this part of the river. So this is an awesome lure to throw for these fish. I'm actually gonna set my drag even lighter. I wanna make it pretty dang light because I do not wanna hook it to a big fish and lose it because I have my hook right now. If I had a lighter setup, with lighter line, that'd probably be better. And I just lost another fish because my drag was actually too loose that time. So what I'll do is, I'll make my drag kind of tight for the hook set. And whenever I actually hook into a fish, I'll just let off and let the fish play. There we go. That was right up on that dam. This one doesn't feel as big. Let's see what it is. And it is, oh, it's a largemouth bass. Second fish, second species. Another one on that little tiny minnow. Look at that. It's a little chunky bass. This fish right here hit it as soon as it hit the water, right up in that current. Little largemouth. See you, buddy. Thanks for biting. So the amount of water that comes out of this spillway fluctuates. For a few minutes, it'll be rushing really fast like this. And then give it 10, 15 minutes the water will be about half as fast. So it's a pretty cool place to fish. The water is hot, as I mentioned. So the thing is, when you're fishing on days like this, below freezing, that hot water on your rod can freeze fast because the hot water freezes faster than the cold. It's only like 30 degrees. It's not that bad outside. So today I'm not really dealing too much with that issue. If it was a lot colder, then my rods would definitely be freezing up a lot easier. There's a fish. Finally. Whoa, whoa. That's that's a nice fish. He just screamed out drag. Hopefully that is another hybrid. 
the way you hit it, I think it is. And like I said, I obviously I just loosened my drag up quite a bit, so I don't, or at least so I have a better chance of not bending out my hook. But right now, this is just taking me down current. Might have to walk down a little bit. I want to see this fish. The head shakes on this thing are crazy. No! Are you kidding me? I'm about to cry, guys. I'm about to cry. Caught that first fish. Caught that second one. Ever since then, nothing. Just losing fish. I suck. And I'm pretty sure it was another hybrid because of those head shakes. The way that fish hit it and just took off. That's exactly what it feels like. And if I had to guess, weight, at least six pounds or more. Because it was fighting really, really good. Just scream drag. Could have been bigger, could have been pushing 10 because there are 10s in here. We'll never know. There's a fish. Wow, first cast with a new lure. I'll show you guys exactly here in a second what I'm using. Let's go. I'm praying I can actually land this one. It's another hybrid. Can't tell if it's bigger. It looks about the same size. Yeah, maybe a little bit smaller. I actually just switched lures to yet another jerk bait, but I went with a bigger profile but the key with this bait right here, I'm about to show you, stronger hooks. That's why I chose this lure. It's a different color, very more bright. It's just a pure white trick bait. Another Rapala slow sinking. But this is not a bad fish. Yet again, right when the water went up. Wow, he's barely hooked. There we go, second hybrid striped bass, third fish of the morning. This one's probably just around three pounds. A little bit smaller than that first fish, but nonetheless an awesome catch. The target species. Surprisingly, I threw the swim bait around. I might've got a few hits, but nothing. So I went back to a jerk bait. This one's a little bit bigger and a bright white pattern. Another slow sinker. Another beautiful hybrid striper. So I'm gonna go ahead and hurry up let him go and as I mentioned that was first cast with this lure so this water is rushing a lot right now hopefully we can get another hook on right now and I definitely feel more confident whenever I hook a fish on this lure as opposed to the first jerk bait just because I don't have to worry about these hooks bending out I'm not saying it can't happen but it's definitely a lot more harder for the fish to do so with this bait right here There's one. I want to hit him. Oh my gosh, he came back for it. Oh my gosh. That was crazy. I was going to say, I felt him hit on the pause. Set the hook, lost him. That might have been a different fish that I just hooked into, though. What could have happened was I hooked into one, he came off, and then his buddy came in and swooped it right back. But the head shakes these guys give are insane. They're so hard fighters. I don't know how big this one is yet. I haven't really got a good look, but that was amazing. That was such a cool eat. This one might be bigger. Come on, buddy. He feels bigger. Oh yeah, that's definitely a bigger fish. Not a giant, but definitely an upgrade. Biggest of the morning. This fish freaking hammered it. That thing went ballistic when he got hooked too. Yeah, I think I probably hooked his buddy. Came off and this guy came in and took it. This one's a fat one. This is probably still about the same size as the first fish I caught this morning, but very healthy looking fish. Such a fun fight. And like I said, I hooked into one, popped off. Broke my heart for just a second, but this guy came back and fixed that up for me. Let's go. 
beauty of a fish out of a hot water discharge. Super warm water and very mean fish. Thank you, buddy. There he goes. My goodness, guys. So much fun. There's my buddy, Parker, just walked up. Coming down here, hopefully he can get on some as well. He was actually fishing out here the other day and caught one just shy of 10 pounds. So that's why I said I know there's 10 pounds in here. Yeah, I noticed when the water was down like this. No one. Really? Yep. Oh, wow. What were you saying when the water's down? When the water's down like this, they typically don't bite. This is not that big. Dude, they might be out. I mean, they're definitely out in the current as well. Yeah. Look at this guy. On the A-Rig. Wow. Is that your first one on the A-Rig? First one on the A-Rig. Ever? Love the A -rig. Have you caught him on that before? Uh-uh. Look at this guy. You need a camera on. Yeah. Here. What? Show that camera. Look at that, guys. <laughs> That's cool. You got your first A-Rig bass. Yeah. Was that your first cast? <laughs> no, second cast. Oh. Second freaking cast. Oh, there's one. Look at those head shakes. Get him. <laughs> oh my gosh. Get him. Oh, what the? It's a little one. Is that a large one? Oh. And no, it's a little hybrid. Nice. Yep. Like I said before, if you guys are gonna hold these fish, you gotta hold freaking tight so you don't get a freaking hook in your hand because they will thrash. That's a little one. See ya. So far, the best luck I've had is on this I believe it's the X-Wrap. I know it's a Rapala trick bait and it suspends. Got a little bit of feather and tassel on the end, the back hook. I am working my bait pretty fast as well. No particular way, just giving it random jerks and pauses. Just working it pretty fast. That's how they seem to like it. Comment down below what species you guys want to see more of. I know on the channel, all my recent videos have been musky fishing. This morning, I wanted to get out and do something different, give that a break. But just comment down below what you guys like to see the most and also comment down what you want to see more of. Something that I do not do as often. Nate! Nate! I got one! How big? Not moving? It's a hybrid, right? And I was like, what is he doing? And uh, oh yeah, he got it. Yeah, it's not a bad one. Oh, he's pulling that drag, dude. Let's go. Come on, buddy. Oh yeah, he's Chunk. Chunkzilla, oh my God. He's a chunky boy. All right, you wanna get him for me? It doesn't hurt him, there you go. Yeah, right. Chunk, that's probably like a three pounder. Is that your first fish in the morning? Second one. Oh yeah, second. You got that one on second pass. Ooh, first fun. decent one. Those fins are crazy. Ooh, I love spots. these fish. They're so fun. Heck yeah. All right. All right, let's get that scale. I'm ready. I got it. Already. I guess two and three quarter. All right. <laughs> two and a half. You were, you were close. close. Basically right there. Not bad. Not bad. Look at that. The broken up pattern. Yeah, that's how you know the hybrids. Let's do Broken it. Broken up stripes. No way for the bite. Give me the bite. Bite my finger. And then I know you're ready. Oh, he's biting. Oh, he's biting. Cranked. Never mind. <laughs> All right. Good job. Let's go. Which, which? There is one. You got one? Yep. Nice. Finally, it's been a minute. Oh! What is that? Card. What the heck? Bro, that's a giant. Here, I'm gonna help. It's a buffalo, I think. Dude, he, I hooked it in the mouth. I actually caught this thing. I'm telling you, dude, they like it. Yeah. He ate it. Oh! 
third species. All right, let me uh, let me get my thing out. Hold on. I think it's a buffalo. I think so. Buffalo. If you don't catch a carp here, what are you doing? Uh, oh, you know no. what carps? I they've eat like eating the lures. All right, I gotta get. Dude, that's a big. That's the biggest one I've seen here. They get way bigger than this. This is a baby. Oh, oh, oh my gosh! This thing is huge. Third species. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is a buffalo carp. I'm not 100% sure. I think it is though. That top dorsal fin, that's crazy looking though, ain't it? He ate it too. Another one I went back to, the original bait I started off the day with. So here, it's just a second, but. That's a cool fish though. I'm not gonna complain about this one at all. It's actually a pretty fish. Oh shit, I almost lost your grippers. Free, bud. See ya. It's a muskie. Oh, it's a hybrid. Holy crap. You actually got a hybrid. Holy shit, it's my first hybrid ever from here. Wow. Holy crap. Dude, that's a nice one. Yeah, it is. Why are they over here? I'm gonna put on a different jerk bait. Holy shit. Look at that, guys. Dude, that's, that's a that's nice cool. hybrid. How am I gonna get this? Ah, open mother. Look at him. Why is he biting so damn hard? Let's go. First hybrid ever. Dude, that's a nice one. Ow. Are you okay? Here, Dude, I'll he's go. biting freaking hard. Here, get the hook off. He, here, do you want to weigh him? I'm going to weigh him. That's a nice one. Holy Look shit. at that. That's a good fish. That's a really that's nice one. That's a beautiful one. one. Oh my God. I didn't even know they were back here. Look at that fish, guys. That is actually beautiful. Three, three and a half, uh, three, almost three and a half. A little over, yeah, three and a half. That's nice. Let's go. What an awesome catch, man. I did not expect that. Really didn't expect much at all, but the colors on these fish are amazing. And the fins, dude. Freaking tear you up. That's awesome. Wow. Caught him on that A-rig. That's crazy. Legal A-rig. Yeah. Two hooks. We're yeah. in Illinois, so we're allowed two hooks. You got two hooks I'm on sure him and this. a dummy. Just toss them in. Really? Yeah. Think he's gonna be okay? Yeah, it's only a foot or two. Nice. All right, get your <laughs> stuff. Go, get man. your stuff. Let's go. Well, where there's one, there's usually more. So. I hope. Oh god! Oh my god! He destroyed it. Are you serious? Oh my god, right there. He just destroyed it. No way, bro. Right he literally just destroyed it on the bank. Oh! Oh my gosh. That caught me so off guard. I watched him eat it. Dude, are you serious? Yeah, it came out of nowhere. It's a hybrid. Here. I wa I watched this. scared the shit out of me. Why did you do that? You because I watched him eat it in front of me. Holy Don't get him stuck on that stick. Dude. Dude. Because he came, I was about to lift it out of the water. I saw. He scared the he came, he came from behind, from underneath, just like, vroom. Dude, that's a nice so one. So fast. Yeah, that's it a is. nice one. I'm getting down there. Let's go, guys. Dude, get him. Oh, let's go. This is so him. much fun. This is freaking awesome. Right. Just be careful, cause yeah. the trouble hooks. Okay. Oh, dude, that's a good one. That's he's a, got that thing T-boned. That's another like two and a half right there. It might be a three. Oh, it's a two nah, he's a, he's a two pounder. He's not as big as yours. Yours was definitely bigger. He scared the shit out of me. I don't know he scared me. All right. Done. Nice, dude, dude. Let's go. We got two of them. Let's go, baby. Dude. Here. This is so random. I've never caught anything here. Holy, here's your fish. Here. You caught yours on the air rig. I got mine on the white dirt <laughs> bait. Second fish. First one for me in this spot. Beautiful, man. These are definitely one of my favorite fish to catch. They fight so hard. I screamed like a little girl when this fish came up and ate it because I was about to lift that lure out of the water. 
and this thing just came up and swallowed it as I watched it. So awesome. Not as big as yours, but I will still take it. Decent little hybrid, probably pound and a half, pushing two pounds. Let's go. A little bit of a side flop, but he'll be all right. Dude, that scared the heck out of me. Man, that's crazy. So we came to this little spot, this little creek, river, whatever you want to call it, in hopes of catching a large moth bass or just anything, but we did not expect to catch hybrids, which I mean, I'm not that surprised because this does connect to a river right downstream that has a whole bunch of hybrids. Dude, another one. Dude, dude. No, this one's bigger. This one's bigger. Dude, look at the head shake. Oh look at God. the drag. This might be, dude. This one's bigger. Right, next cast. Dude. This was the very next cast. Look at it. This thing is big. Oh my God. Look at the drag. This might be a, dude, this might be a four pounder. It four might. or five, four or five pounder right here. That right. was the very next cast. Oh, this is a good one. Look at him fight, dude. Oh, Heck yeah. yeah. That's a nice one. <gasps> Let's go, dude. Let's go. This is so fun. This has got me hyped. Okay, we got him. So dude. hyped, dude. We got him. Keep that drag. Keep that drag. You hear that dude That's screaming? Insane. He's not even moving. <laughs> He's not even moving. Guys, that was so next cast. Let me get down there. Oh my gosh. God. Look at him. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Dude, I hope he doesn't get me stuck under something because no, he no, keeps no. going. Just don't bring him right that thing right there. That's the only there's really not that much. Look problem. at my rod bend. <laughs> this thing is huge. We got big birds flying. Look at my rod. This thing is huge. This is definitely a five. Look, look at my rod tip, the rat, the head shakes. Look at it. It just keeps bowing up and down. I think this is a five pounder. I think this is a four or five. I'm not even joking. This thing is huge. I got my drag set. Oh dude, he's Lighter. huge. Oh my god, I can see him. My drag is set loose enough to where if he wants oh to go. God. He's a nice one. He's a really nice one. Yeah, it is. This might be my PB. Cause hey, watch I, out, there's, watch your there's brush right here. There's a snag right here. Yeah, he's wrong way. Fuck. Don't go that way. God oh, damn it. Oh my God. No. Okay, oh, okay, good. Yeah, he's yeah. turned around. There you go. Here, walk this way, walk this way. I'm trying. I just don't know how. Oh, shit. Oh my God. He's No! 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 Dude! He kept going the wrong way with the brush. And then my line got stuck on one of the branches. And yeah, you saw the rest. Okay, I don't even, I don't even want to talk about it anymore. I just want to retie a leader, put a new leader on, put my drink bait back on and keep casting. Come on, guys. That's ridiculous. That's unbelievable. That way? Maybe we should, you wanna walk down more? I want to, then work my way back up. Yeah. 